Hello guys, welcome back to yet another video. It's nice to see that Nothing have been rolling out updates for CMF phones and that too based on Nothing OS 3.2. Day before yesterday, CMF phone 1 received the update and now today, CMF phone 2 Pro have received the same update. In this video, we'll talk about every change, what you guys will see with this latest update. But before moving ahead guys, if you find our content useful, then make sure to smash the like button and also consider subscribing. So here I have my CMF phone 2 Pro and let me show you the about section or you can say software information by going to about phone you can see here nothing OS 3.2 and the Android version it's based on Android 15 and now we have the first June 2025 security patch if you take a look at the build number it's 1258 you can see the change logs and the update size was 407 MB for CMF phone 2 Pro and if you guys haven't received the OTA update you can just go to the settings sometimes we don't get to see the notification on nothing phones so go to the about section go to software info and tap here which says nothing OS if you still don't see just tap on check for update see as per the change logs they have mentioned few improvements in the camera segment but I personally did not notice much of improvements I'll show you the camera samples before and after so you guys can judge yourself now let's talk about the change logs first one it says general improvements and bug fixes and here you can see an option which says you can now reset private space password using lock screen password in the reset option but if you go to the reset options I did not find any option to reset the password of private space I mean using the lock screen password I'm not sure whether it has been added somewhere else. I did check out the locks in settings also, but there also I couldn't find anything. So if you guys are aware about it, do let me know in the comment section below where is this specific setting can be found. And after that they say they have improved the stability of pop-up view. So here also I did not notice any kind of major improvements. Towards the left hand side you can see that was a video recorded before updating the device and on the main screen this is after the update. So I personally did not notice any kind of improvements over here. After that they say they have enhanced the stability of pattern unlock on lock screen. I personally never use pattern unlock, either I use the fingerprint or the pin option. So some users might have faced some issues wherein nothing have taken care of. After that they say they have fixed an issue with noise during calls in very rare scenarios. I personally never had any kind of complaints from the other party like you know there's too much of background noise. I've used this device as my primary phone but never got any kind of complaints. Later on they have updated the security patch to June. After that moving on to the camera improvements here they have optimized few things. But one thing nothing really needs to fix and that's the focus issue on this phone. This phone struggles to focus a lot whenever you try to take the device closer to an subject and it's so irritating you can also see a video before and after i thought it would be fixed after this update like it got the camera update but still it's the same story i seriously want nothing to focus on the camera segment it's so inconsistent then they say they have optimized the noise issue when using the telephoto lens in very rare scenario so here are some of the photos which i clicked using the 2x telephoto lens and trust me i did not see any major improvements as i told you guys initially the camera is inconsistent sometimes it produces similar images and sometimes there are color separation and in terms of clarity before and after it's exactly same there are no major noticeable improvements after that they say they have also enhanced the photo quality in outdoor scenes here are the photos which we clicked before and after of the outdoor scene after this update i did notice the photos which are being produced are slightly on the brighter side and that doesn't look natural but when it comes to skin tone yes slight improvements are there previously we had slight warm tone but now photos looks very close to natural then they also say improved clarity in certain night scenes so here are the photos which i tried to click under low light and personally did not notice major improvements photos are slightly on the brighter side after this latest update as i told you and that can also be seen in the photos which we clicked in the low light i mean the night mode was activated then they say they have improved the camera stability and smoothness so here in terms of camera stability i would like to mention about this focus issue which you guys can see on the screen it's a lot irritating and as they have mentioned about the stability so this thing should have been improved after this latest update but when it comes to smoothness i would say yes smoothness is slightly improved now the opening and closing animation of camera application is a lot better compared to previous build and you can see the video side by side before and after updating the device and one more thing which i wanted nothing to fix and that's the color shifting if you take a look at the video which is played on the screen you can see uh, while switching between 1x and 2x i mean between the primary and telephoto lens there's a lot of color shifting and it looks pathetic and the last fix is related to brightness changes in gallery during zooming so i did test out before and after towards the left hand side you can see that video that was before and on the main screen we have the after update video i personally never had any kind of brightness related issues in the
the gallery application by the way guys nothing gallery 2.0 is now live which lets you edit videos and photos they have also added some filters around 10 filters have been added we have done a dedicated video on that make sure to check it out they have bought some cool add-ons in the nothing gallery application so guys this was all about the latest update of nothing os 3.2 for cmf phones if you guys have any kind of questions drop them in the comment section below this is your friend ashok signing out see you guys in the next video even when you feel low you can still go even when you feel slow you can still go even when there's no hope you can still go i never ran to the no man i still go go go